lightship Nantucket, one of the largest and most complete in the world, leaves home waters in Boston Harbor for her Atlantic station. It's her maiden voyage, so she's a sort of dark lightship, and on the way out she's hailed by the Boston, now a wheezy old lady, compared to the graceful lines and spruce interior of young Nan. No wonder her bluff, hard-as-nail skipper and crew are proud of her, and that her wireless operator will go to any wavelength, so to speak, to keep her radio equipment in perfect order. He has a responsible job, too, for on the proper working of a light ship's wireless may depend the very lives of the men who adventure in these dangerous waters. The apparatus controls transmitter, beacon, lights, fog and submarine signals, and oscillator for measuring the ship's roll. Here's the roll being measured. Well, there she goes on her brave errand, and she carries with her an anchor and chain weighing 15 tons. The warning note of her foghorn can be heard 14 miles away. To reach the beacon light means a climb of 65 feet which is no mean feat in rough weather. The lamp flashes every eight seconds, and when visibility is good, it can be seen for nearly 15 miles. Good luck to her! <laughs> 